Good morning, Nathaniel. Good morning. Where, where are we going? Good. Going to the Thomas Sale Tours. You're right. We sure are. Yeah. I, I don't remember going to that place. You don't? Well, we're going to refresh your memory, okay? Can you show me what you have in your hand? And what else do you have in your hand? A quarter. Can you show me the quarter? Oh, there's a quarter. What are we going to talk about today? A quarter. A gypsy... Moth. Um, a gypsy moth is smaller than a quarter. Yeah. Oh, put your passy down. Yeah. All right. Who made the beautiful gypsy moth? I know. I know. God made the beautiful gypsy moth because he loves us so. In other news, we have a sleeping beauty in the other seat. Let's see if I can get you a picture. There we go. Andrew's our sleeper this morning. All right, we're going to read just a little bit about the gypsy moth. The gypsy moth is a very tiny moth. It could fit on the quarter. But even though they're small, Jesus made the gypsy moth very smart. A gypsy moth can find another gypsy moth, even if it is very far away. Nathaniel, if you were all alone in this car and there were people outside, could you find them? You might be able to, but what if they were way down the street? What if they were two miles away? Jesus made the gypsy moth able to find another one even if it's two and a half miles away. That's a long way. God made them able to do that so they could find each other and have families instead of flying around all lost and alone. We can say thank you God for always being able to find me. Did you know that no matter where you are, God can find you? God is way smarter than a gypsy moth and we're so thankful that we serve a great big God. This story was taken from the Hugs from Jesus devotional book by Sally Pearson Dillon. It is an awesome devotional book. One that any family with preschoolers would enjoy having. Goodbye, goodbye. Thank you for joining us. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Come back again, we'll see you soon. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Hope you guys have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow.